Hi, this is Highbridge Caravan Stevan Branch on a an unseasonably warm but probably how it should be spring like 2024 day and we have found a spare 20 minutes just to do our monthly vlog and for those who haven't seen one before this is where we have a walk around the forecourt what bit of forecourt we can get to as you can see we're very full um, talk about the industry what's new what's coming in what's going out what's selling and what's not and what changes are afoot so spring has well and truly sprung here at Highbridge Devon the daffodils are coming out it's all good and we have got as you can see absolutely bucket loads of stock bucket loads of sold ones like these used Baileys and mobile Vetta there and loads and loads of new and used stock so industry's changed a bit over the last few months the new vans are starting to come in and uh, used vans are starting to uh, to, to sell again which is good so manufacturers have now got a steady supply line of all the different chassis so whereas the last few years everything's been a bit stop start with covid and rushing invasions of places meaning the manufacturers haven't been able to get the chassis demand's been massive supply's been low and now things are having a bit of a reset and going back to some sort of normality and how they should do and that is quite healthy to be fair it's a bit of a shock for those who are used to part exchanges that are worth the same as they cost new 20 years ago and things like that so prices aren't crashing on used vans but they are coming down a little bit because when you price a used motorhome basically you quite simply and well, this is what I do look at the price of what the equivalent new would cost today and then work back from there so now we can get new ones used ones have to be a bit cheaper new van prices aren't going up as badly anymore which is great and there's a lot more of them out there and that means used ones are just appreciating a little bit but they are still selling and they are still a lot of very desirable stock out there so have a little look at what we have new out there so the market has been somewhat swamped with camper vans to, to, to say the least so i'd say a lot of the bigger manufacturers got on board with the demand for these smaller non-toilet non-shower camper vans and basically everybody launched one all at the same time from vans like the adria um well, i used to call it three-way space the adria active over there on the Renault. Uh, obviously hillside have been around forever building high quality vws wild axe proteus uh, as well as all the sort of smaller aftermarket converters and then swift or sleeper everybody does one um, so the market got a little bit swamped with them and what we are seeing is a lot of people who bought the smaller camper end of it over lockdown a lot of people think that during covid everybody who couldn't fly to Torre Malise on, on EasyJet was just coming in and buying a motorhome who was never otherwise going to buy one and that wasn't the case a lot of people who've had them before or who were going to buy one anyway all decided to buy one at the same time and a lot of those people probably bought something like this thinking we'll use it for days out and such like but a decent number of them have now realized that maybe if they're slightly older they're not using it as a daily vehicle they just wanted the next size up so that's what's really really booming uh, full-size van conversions with toilet and shower uh, narrow body coach belts like the Adria compact up there and of course coach boots will drop down beds so they're all the halo bits of stock out there um, but that means there's some good deals to be had on camper vans and there is still a demand for these and it's it is from a lot of people we're finding who are maybe buying something like this and getting rid of a car having one set of running costs low depreciation uh, and also uh, increasingly a lot of people may be getting rid of a big coach belt and they're buying a caravan that does the job of the big coach belt and towing it with a camper van that replaces the car um, so that's been quite popular but because of the supply demand thing it is leveling out but there's some great deals out there so wild axe for instance they did a six thousand pound off Proteus range which is their transit custom offering um, for the NEC show and they've carried that on so this is a genuine manufacturer offer we do have to contribute uh, part of it as a dealer but that means a six thousand pound off so you can have this brand new 
Proteus automatic with full leather diesel heating for what's that 50 8995 and that's a great buy for that sort of money it's a really good offer and then they do the sport which is all the um, body kit and uh, the very smart black alloys and things that's a manual gearbox same thing diesel heater full leather and that brings that down to 63980 which again is a really really good buy now looking at the manufacturers and what we've got so we'll start off with hillside uh, Hillside are a VW conversion specialist from Derbyshire. Uh, we've got in stock their MAN base, which is a VW craft of any other name, uh, based Hillside Hopton. This is an end lounge with a toilet and shower. Uh, medium wheelbase, six metres, very manageable in size, ridiculously high quality, automatic. We just sold this one, actually, the other day, but we've got a couple of others coming down. Indium Grey, uh, we've got 180 horsepower in stock, which is going to replace this one on display duties, and uh, a 140, a uh, pair of another 140 silver and grey coming down. All different internal colours and specs but brilliantly high quality vans these are sort of 80 odd and then hillside we've just got the one birch over classic left for the year which is uh, their vw offering so we've got this one here which is we're just going to reduce this actually because we sold its sister van um, we knocked it down to 59 and 95 so you could have this brand new birch over classic um, hillside use german sca roof french rib bed Proper German or Basto diesel heater, brand new unregistered at 59.95, which again is a good buy. So there's some good buys in the camper end of it. Um, also, Wild Axe wise, we've got a Triton. Triton is the long wheelbase uh, Ford based camper um, with a toilet and shower at the back, based on a Westphalia design but built and uh, edited by Wild Axe, who are part of Rapido, who are part of the Westphalia group. Um, rear toilet and shower in a pop top camper that's about 70,000 that one so they're still selling there's still a lot of uh, demand for those so go away and have your toilet and shower but still fit under a height barrier and have a usable day-to-day -day vehicle uh, we've got a couple of swift carreras here which we're not allowed to talk about because we're not swift agents but they're just passing through and then uh, Duncan, the MD of Wild Axe, visited us yesterday for his annual visit. And we have, we think, pretty much the best display of new Wild Axe in the country. So for immediate availability. So we've got the best selling Solaris XL with the uh, side bunks. So we've got a couple of these in stock. So we keep some in storage as well. So big front lounge vertically stacked single beds or bunks which are six foot five long massive kitchen got a couple of automatic one of these is in stock with all the bells and whistles for 80 europa's been running it close and it's maybe even been our best seller this year with the big end lounge again we have immediate availability here we've got this manual at 79 if you don't mind a manual gearbox this gives you full quilted black leather diesel all wild axes uh, gas tank free now so you've got a gas locker and that just powers your cooker and then you've got diesel for everything else when you're not on the mains or electric when you are on the mains so that's the two bag Europa we've got auto and manual available auto 83 odd manual 79 you'll see James my expert salesman over there squeezing that eight meter bailey through a seven meter gap so uh, hope we're not going to get one of these dash cam live crash events there but um, Shall we give him a shout? You're not crashing that, are you, James? No, James has, has got everything under control, so he doesn't need any help. So, I uh, <laughs> hope for the best there. Um, Pulsar Mark II, we got these on special offer at 74 to 5.4 uh, metres, toilet and shower. Replaced our best seller, the 5 metre um, Pulsar short wheelbase when they discontinued the short wheelbase model. Toilet and shower, big front lounge, perfect for two, 5.4 metres, fudge it into a parking space. This makes a double bed or there's infills to turn it into two big single beds. Kitchen, toilet in 5.4 metres, 74.95, brand new, and that's automatic. Diesel, electric, heating, solar panel, awning, barbecue point, all built in. And we've got the Aurora Leisure XL, which is the end lounge front single dinette, so it gives you the flexibility of turning your end lounge back there leaving it made up as a double bed this makes a single bed at the front with a seat belt and you've got a good size end lounge back there makes a double bed toilet shower massive fridge freezer 
microwave, full oven. Don't get that from anybody else in this layout, do you? So we've got a couple of these as well. This one's a auto. Again, same spec, all of them, diesel, electric, solar, and uh, awning. Little Wild Axe Aurora, six meter with a transverse fixed bed. This one's a manual gearbox at 76 and a half brand new. These are fantastic quality vans as well. And you're sort of paying not a lot more than Swift Eldest money for a really top quality van. So this one, someone slid the forward facing seat down so you'd swivel your driver's seat around. That makes a single bed for a guest. And then at the back, someone's been playing around with that as well. You've got a, I'd have to push that back down, a transverse big fixed bed that will all fold away, leaving that whole area floor to ceiling as storage if you need it to be. Very, very clever. You can have this as a six meter van and it has the smaller fridge freezer with the wardrobe beneath or you can have it as a 6.34 meter van and that gives you the bigger fridge freezer basically and the microwave uh, we have both in stock so the the XL the 6.34 meter van has just been delivered and it's got the panoramic front skylight option sky view which is a two and a half thousand pound option from wild axe so James has managed to extricate the massive bailey out of the very small gap I shall sneak past. Next up's the Constellation 3XL. Two of these in stock, one with Skyview at the front, one without. This is a manual, so we do have a few manual gearboxes out there. It's a £3,000 option, that automatic gearbox. Um, so if you don't have to have an auto, save yourself three grand, gets you a lot of holidays. That massive front lounge, look at all that floor space. Massive kitchen. Um, Super spacious, you can have it as a six meter if you prefer, but 6.3, same wheelbase. 77 with all that same spec again, or we do have an auto with the Skyview Skylight option just come in if you want that bucket of space. Altair, flagship of the range, gas free, 99,000 pounds, but this beats the price increase, so these are now gone up to 110, so you're saving 10,000 pounds plus on these if you buy the ones we currently have in stock we got a couple of these in stock one with leather one with cloth this one's got leather and that gives you the longitudinal raised fixed singles uh, lithium triple solar double lithium um, full length massive five meter awning with an awning light all built in automatic on the man which is a volkswagen crafter and that's it for the Wild Axes. So there's, I don't think there's a Wild Axe we don't have, actually. And they're all available for immediate delivery. It won't last forever, that. But if you ever want to look at or buy a Wild Axe, now's the time to do it. Now, Adria-wise, we are massive Adria dealers here. We work the Adria stand at the show. Compact DL. Adria Compact Supreme DL. It's been a stratospherically good buy. So whereas a lot of people bought camper vans and then changed them to those... A lot of people with big coach belts bounced down to them and found them a bit small and are now bouncing back up to these. So this is 6.99 metres, three and a half tonne with a good payload, big garish, uh, narrow body, easy to drive down the country lanes, lighter than a van conversion with a better payload, better storage. These are about 88, a lot of money, but beautiful vans. So parallel safer front lounge with huge skylights. And then the typical European layout of single beds at the back, which make a huge double over a garage. Fantastic vans. Um, we've had so many of these, we've managed to buy some extra ones. Because to be fair, there are, I would like to talk honestly about the industry, there are some dealers, mainly sort of the caravan heavy ones or some of the northern dealers, um, who have hit some problems this year. Um, so we're still doing well. But to say when the market slows a little bit and supply goes up those who maybe sort of uh, aren't prepared for it so much who haven't been around as long can suffer a little bit and that has uh, released some extra stock into the industry so we snapped up as many of these as we could get we've sold all of them and we've got two left for the year this one here which we were keeping for display but i think we'd now make it available has got factory tow bar solar double battery the big fridge option the automatic gearbox taken in at about 89 
then we've got a manual gearbox. So there's one left with a manual gearbox, uh, which hasn't been delivered yet. Exactly the same as that. Hasn't got so many options, and that would be bringing her in sort of in the, the sort of sub 85,000 bracket anyway for someone who doesn't mind having a manual box changing gear yourself. Uh, which some people don't mind, to be fair, and it gets you a, a lot, lot cheaper van. Now, Shoson wise, we're Britain's biggest and oldest Shoson dealer, and we've got X550, which is the little baby six meter drop down narrow body, first production. Um, narrow body six meter drop down that I can think of in the industry someone will now say that Wigan did it years ago or something like that but um, but six meter drop downs in a wide van been out a long time six meter narrow body drop downs haven't I think maybe Wigan did do it they're a very expensive low volume Italian manufacturer but I could be wrong but the X series as you can see it's got the whole off-road vibe going on super modern very designed inside kind of make everything else feel out of date but um, it's a finish that isn't for everybody I kind of like it fits a huge amount in inside so we've got an x550 they do an x650 now which is a um, similar to that but with a different bathroom and garage on the back still narrow body so James is uh, a way fitting more big vans into small gaps there he's doing very well if there's anybody else that feel nervous about that but James is an expert now our best seller and we've pretty much sold out of these, so that's 40 odd we've sold for the year. Uh, is the 7 meter uh, Shoson 640 Titanium Ultimate. So this one is or was being kept for display. We might make it available, I don't know. Speak to us if you've got a nice part exchange or you're local. We might sell it now, I'd have to find out. We do have others coming through. We've got a used one, very slightly used, which I'll show you in a moment. So 6 meter drop down, 7 meter drop down. And for those who want to split the difference, I think this is my favourite of the lot of them actually. I do love the 640, but I really like this. This is the, I've done individual videos of all of these as well. Shows on 650, a tape line. It's like a shrunk 640, so it's got the front drop down, it's got the mid kitchen, a full width end bathroom with a garage. Same bathroom and garage as a 640, just slightly smaller lounge and kitchen. Saving two foot of space, 6.4 metres. It still gives you the drop down bed which is slightly tapered in. I like this new light wood pine sort of finish, I think that's rather pretty. Same bathroom and garage as a 640, big separate shower, big rear garage. Usable kitchen because you just use the table as prep space and then cook over there. Still got a big fridge freezer in 6.4 meters. I think these are brilliant. Now these are a special edition for this year based on the manual Peugeot to keep prices down. Manual only, 69.95, but that's with barbecue point, external shower, cab blinds, reversing camera, solar panel, and an awning. Uh, so you're not having to add anything, which is just fantastic. Um, Adria wise, we do have an Adria coach built as well. We're waiting for some more Adria twin panel vans to come in. Uh, we're eldest dealers these days, eldest are the same company as Compass. We've got a couple of Compasses. This little Navigator 120 is the same as an Eldis Accordo 120. It's a six meter narrow body van. Uh, it's actually was last year's model, but it's just been delivered. So uh, even Peugeot were struggling sometimes to get the chassis through still. So these are about 65. We've got them on special offer. Two berth, N lounge, lightweight, simple as anything. Very roomy. Do you a bit of a deal on any of these compasses. Even though they've just been delivered, they are last year's models. Compass Concerto 255 is their flagship model on the automatic Fiat Ducato. Again, this one just been delivered. Um, even though it's sort of, say it's last year's model, it's exactly the same as this year's model. You can see it's still got the plastic on it. Big parallel sofa front lounge with a side fixed bed and a bathroom with a separate shower. Uh, these are a lot of money and I can't remember how much money. About 85, 81, that one's 81 with the automatic gearbox and the awning. I think that's on special offer. Is this one reduced, James? Like three or 4, yeah, that's it. So that should have been about 85. We've actually reduced it before it even arrived, that one. So some good good, uh, good deals to be had there. We've got a 150 there with an island bed, brand new. It's reduced from 70 down to 68. Again, there's deals to be had here on the existing new stock. Come speak to us, we'll never be beaten on price knowingly, anywhere on value. So that's about it for the new ones. So I would say, each manufacturer has one or two halo models which are selling very well so from Eldis or Compass as they were it's the uh, 
it's the van conversions which are real winners so these are nearly sold out for the year but we've got this new Aldis AutoQuest CV40 automatic it's our only one left for the year which is available for immediate uh, delivery which is an end lounge front half donette or if you want it with a pop top we've got one there so these are both available straight away once we sell them they've gone but no no need to wait if you've got one on order for somewhere else you can get out of it because it's not arrived give us a call and uh, come and uh, come and get one off of us while they're here so that's about new so you manufacture halo models from each so Adria you've got the twin Supremes the compact show on wise we do very well with the drop-down bed ones the 640 and the 650 that we just looked at Wild Axe wise, we've got the whole product line because we love Wild Axe. We're Britain's second biggest Wild Axe dealer and Hillside, it's of course the Hoptons on the MAN. So we've got the stock that we want from each. Now what we do have as well is a fully stocked used lineup for the first time in years, including some absolute crackers like that, which I'll come back to in a moment because we'll start at the end and work down. So now all the new vans are coming in. The used vans are coming in as well in part exchange, which is brilliant, but it's a perfect storm. So I'll do individual videos of all of these. Now right at the moment, a lot of people who bought in the last year or two have been picking up, and that means their part exchanges are coming in. We're in that bubble now between the 1st of March when the 24 plates come out, and Easter, which is quite early this year. So it's been quite stressful. That's why you might notice not a lot of videos coming out of me, because I've been either off watching football or the horses at Cheltenham <laughs> or and then in between trying to catch up um, with all the questions from all the people waiting to pick up their new vans uh, but now we're going to try and catch up a little bit but we have got so much good used stock and we're pricing it right as well internet price check these vans folks and you will find that they all really really stack up so starting from the end here used full-size fixed bed van conversions we've got some belters to be fair um, this one just came in it's an original auto trail v-line 2014 now auto trail v-lines today are fine it's just like any other van conversion auto trail v-lines when they came out they put their own roof on they put the body kit on um, they were very very with these massive windows in they were very very stylish vans and very expensive vans and then they got too expensive to build so this is one I sold a year or two ago to Glen. Just took it back in part exchange. So it's transverse fixed bed. But look at the style of this. It's like a, a sort of hybrid between a coach built and a van conversion. So transverse fixed rear bed, automatic gearbox, plenty of space there. Um, twin 12 cab seats obviously. And the big panoramic skyline storage in the roof, rear speakers. It's really cool. Everything's sort of covered up there, cooking wise. Yeah, it's a smart thing. Uh, this will be priced at 43.95, I think. Um, yeah, nice thing. As is this Weinsberg Fire Edition over here. I've not had one of these before. Weinsberg are German, they're part of Naus. But this is a Fire Edition, a special edition. So you've got the beautiful lake blue metallic paint. With these fantastic fire graphics big full length awning this one's a manual gearbox very modern sort of two-tone upholstery transverse fixed bed again very good news at 48.95 wild axe europa so say our joint best-selling wild axe this year you're looking knocking on 80 for a new one this one's three year old say 15 grand, 5,000 pound a year retail depreciation. So, well this obviously wasn't cost, didn't, this didn't cost 80 odd when it were new of course. So. But nothing changed, same layout. It's got the old stripey upholstery, but big end lounge. Rare wood finish, this was, was the Kronberg wood, which you didn't see as often, I kind of like that. And this was the optional sort of sandy coloured um, upholstery, really, really nice. And that's a lovely van, 63,995. Step out there, steps a bit inside. And they came all the way down from Scotland or Cumbria to buy a van off of those. This one's we're bought in, we're not massively buying in at the moment, but we got offered this and uh, can turn it down really. So it's a 2018, despite what the window sheet says, uh, Catargo um, from Germany, actually built in Slovenia. These, but Malibu 600, another six meter with a transverse fixed rear bed. You want a six meter quality transverse fixed bed van? That's three of the last four 
this sort of heavy wood German build quality, very, very tough fans. Transverse rear bed again, premium, premium bit of kit. Manual gearbox, 150, 130 brake engine. 49 and 95, 2018 plate. Cheap thing, really, that. This is a cracker. I've just done the individual video of this. It's an Adria Twin Supreme 640 SLB. So we're waiting for some more new ones of these to come in um, at around about 85, 86. This one again, three year old, say 15 grand, 71.95, nine speed auto. It's got Wi Fi, fixed single beds, panoramic front skylight. Uh, these are always really popular. It's a 17 plate auto sleeper Kingham at 54.95. These are really, really popular. Long wheelbase, mega spec auto sleeper finish. One owner from new. Got some really good Continental tyres on. In silver, best colour. One of the few vans to feature a side sofa and a side French bed, but a level of luxurious comfort which only auto sleeper know how to do. And yeah, quality thing. So loads of really, really good used van conversions. And then two really, really good slightly used um, chasons. So that's a 720 with drop down front bed, drop down rear bunks, and this is a 1000 mile 640 at uh, 71,95. So it's five grand less than the new one. It's done a thousand miles. Uh, this is a used version of our very best seller. Still smells new inside. So big parallel sofa front lounge, drop down bed with the big round lights underneath of it, full width bathroom end garage, three and a half ton auto. It's the Titanium Ultimate, it's this year's model, basically. Nothing's changed for 71.95. An immediate availability of a van that we've pretty much sold out of new. So you can't go wrong at that, really. Working down the offside, one of our regular visitors. It's little hillside Birchover Classic with a high top. Very rare, optional high top. They're normally pop tops. High tops are very desirable because they just gives you more storage. If you're older, you don't want to be battling a... A pop top, Whoop. squeeze past there. Cloth seats and all that high top roof space, really, really good. Uh, hob and a grill, 12 volt fridge freezer that obviously just all slides up. Single passenger seat because it's been a camper from new and super tough 1.9 turbo diesel V dub T5 uh, gas power blown air heating as well in that one. So I say new one of them, 60 grand. This one's 23 and a half, and we have sold this twice previously. So this will be number three. Um, yeah, bomb proof, reliable, not a spot of rust. Known proper converter, been a motorhome from new. Bob on, as has this very rare Cavano from Horizons Unlimited. Short wheelbase from a transit specialist converter, front wheel drive, massive 125 horsepower. It's really cool. We'd normally trade one of this age, but um, this is just really nice. So you've got a little lounge with forward facing seat belted seat there. It makes a double bed, you fudge it into singles. Then you've got a full oven, a big fridge freezer, and a little bathroom which just has a, um, what's the word? Porta potty in it and a sink, so I don't think it has a, I don't think it has a shower. Here we go in. I don't want the video to be too long, so you get bored. But yeah, a little bathroom with a porta potty, being five meters. It's really, really good. And for 19.95, six month warranty, new MOT, big engine service, habitation service. Park it in a parking space, get a bit of fun out of it. Factory fitted awning, factory fitted GRP, proper motorhome high top, which is all good. And more full size panel vans. Grand California at 69.95. This consolation's the cheapest 2012 Wild Axe consolation in the country at 34.95. Another one we've sold previously, this will go soon. You can tell when something's about to sell, you start to get flurries of interest in it. I think this one will go soon. Clean, clean that up, it's cleaned up really well now. A couple of premium A-classes over there. This Burston we've not had a chance to price up yet, but it's a big 
island bed, uh, longitudinal single beds over garage burst and a mega mega spec air suspension, gas tank, 360 degree cameras, you'd pay a fortune to get a new one of them, um, had the bonnet wrapped which kind of looks kind of mean I think, um, smart thing that and I can't remember what price it's going up for but it'll be a cheap, cheapest one in the country anyway. Wild Extra Road from the Renault and Lounge Automatic, one owner, I sold it new. Swift Select 184, full berth and lounge van conversion. Morwenna, the Europa, 2022. So the 21 with cloth up there is 63,995. This one's got full leather, it's a year newer. I think it's a year and a half newer. Yeah, it's a 72 plate, but we might just knock that down to 67,995. <laughs> Gives you that big quilted leather end lounge. Yeah, smart thing. But yeah, we'll probably reduce that by a couple of thousand things. It's not sold, but I think it stacks up price-wise at that. Plenty of VWs. We've knocked these down to the lowest possible prices now. This one, I think we've reduced lower than that. I thought this was this is 19.95 now. I think not very often we sell vans for 19.95. It is. So we've lost the uh, lost the price sticker. Someone's put the old one in it. But this double M gives you a VW high roof with a full width three seat belt rear bed, and they've done that by putting the kitchen across the middle, which if it suits would be really good. So it gives you five seat belts and a full width bed instead of having a narrow bed. So there's something to be said for that, but it is a bit niche. But we've sold it a couple of times before, and we'll sell it again. So it's a van we've known for years. Bomb proof 1900 turbo diesel. Got some more scamper vans down there as well. A couple of new globe cars from Germany. As you can see, we're really full, but we do still want your part exchange. So we've got a little bit of space back there. There's some more nice stuff coming in this week as well, um, like um, a six metre drop down automatic bed show son. Two globe cars from Germany here, 5.4 metre fixed bed and a 6 metre fixed bed German van conversion. Again, available for immediate delivery, as is this Triton, which is the Wild Axe with the toilet and shower and the pop top for 70,000. Finally, a little Danbury V dub from one of Britain's oldest VW converters. Just come in, crazy low mileage, 2,000 miles. Rib bed, diesel heater, that unique Danbury sort of build quality, which is very, very good at 55.95. So, we're here to do business. We've got enough stock in the supply line now. We're pricing them sharply, prepping them to the help, and warranting them to the help. So, do give us a call on 01626832792. No matter what you've got, we'll take it in part exchange. We'll either trade it or retail it, and we'll still give you a fair price, even if it's another camper or something like that. Uh, give us a call on 0166 832 792. Call direct on the mobile 07432 If we don't answer the landline, that'll get you through to myself or one of my sales team. Check, check us on the hybridcaravans.co.uk website. Come and see us down at Newton Abbott, Devon, just off the A38 South Devon Expressway. We've got a big workshop, massive accessory shop, awning department. So we might not be as big as Highbridge Somerset, but we're bigger than most other dealers out there. And of course, if you buy a van from us and you're nearer to Somerset, you can pick it up from there. So come and see us and ask us. If you've got any questions about any of these specific vans that you've sent, leave a comment. Give us a buzz, drop us a text, send us an email. Uh, we can send you links to individual videos. And if you could have been offered a deal anywhere, we'll try and beat it because that's what we're here for. The Hybrid Motorhomes Devon. Thank you very much. Bye bye.